Uh, my name's Chris and I live in this three-bedroomed, mid-terraced house. So for today's energy audit, we've enlisted the help of Ella and Lloyd, two eco-energisers from Ashburton Primary School. We've got the thermal imaging camera, we've got the clipboards, we've got everything we need. So should we get going? Yeah. Great, come on. There's lots of CD players and we've got the TV here. I'm hoping they'll point out some areas where I can save money and obviously help the environment as well. I think the biggest savings will be found in the in changing the boiler, which is 30 odd years old. How do you find the rooms upstairs relative to the rooms downstairs? Still quite hot. I find this a very warm house. Probably because you've got two homes on either uh, side yeah, as well. Yeah, partly insulated already with the others, I think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's just that those those two sides yeah. that are sort of yeah. losing yeah. losing heat. Eco-energisers! I quite like the fact that we can make homes more energy efficient and things and I like helping people and making things more energy efficient. If we keep on just using and using, I mean it's just going to... the bills are just going to be out the roof and the world would just be, would be ruined. Point it up there, I bet they see something there. There. If you stand just here, you can feel it coming through there. Oh, blimey, yeah. <laughs> So that's the cold air coming in from the loft where it's not being draft proofed. So you could very cheaply and quickly prevent that. As your building sort of follows this lovely sort of uh, linear path, so it's, it's sort of working as it should really as we sort of depressurize. And so what it says here is that your, um, your, your infiltration rate is 10.8 cubic meters per square meter of surface area. Now the point is not to, don't worry about that, but building regulations at the moment are 10. So what that means is, relative to a new building, you're just slightly over That's how we're a new building, actually, which is amazing. Yeah. This was built 45 years yeah, ago. Yeah. So we've completed our energy audit of Chris's house. He's quite a low gas user, but there are lots of things that he could still do to reduce his electricity and gas consumption further. He's got a really ancient boiler, it's about 30 years old, and a new efficient one could save him about 30% on his bills. He could put another 200 millimetres of insulation in the loft, and he could also investigate insulating between the tiles upstairs in the house and the internal wall. He also is paying quite a high price for his gas, and he should investigate other energy providers to see if he can get a better deal. Finally, He's got a lot of old style light bulbs and replacing them with low energy ones could save him about 80% on his lighting bill. Yeah.